Hi friends, and thanks for tuning in. In Excel, you might come across this issue where you're trying to enter some text or a number that starts with zeros, like 00158. You'll notice that Excel will automatically get rid of those leading zeros, which is sometimes what you want, but what if you do want those zeros to display? What do you do? Well, you can right-click and come into Format Cells and change it to Text. This will usually do the trick. You're going to have to come back in and enter your zeros again. But that will work. If you hover over this error message right here, you'll see that it's saying number stored as text. You can convert it to a number or just ignore the error if this little triangle bothers you. But there's also another way you can fix this just by putting an apostrophe in front of the number. So let's enter another product number here. I'll hit the apostrophe or the single quote. And I'll just make up a number 04879. And the apostrophe basically says, OK, Excel, whatever I type in this cell, I want you to leave it exactly as I typed it. Don't do any sort of abbreviating or reformatting or changing the type. Just treat it exactly as I typed it. So if I hit Enter now, I'll get that 0 in front of it. And the same error that we saw before, I can just ignore that. But now as you're entering future numbers, just hit that apostrophe first your zeros, and then everything will display just the way you want it. Super easy, huh? So that's it. That's how to get your leading zeros to display in Excel. If you found it helpful, be sure to hit that like button and also think about subscribing for more content like this. Thank you so much for watching.